let us solve this problem a tree breaks due to storm and the broken part bends so that the top of a tree touches the ground by making an angle 30 with the ground okay so distance between the foot of the tree and top of a tree is 6 meters now find the height of the tree before falling okay so see here so let us say this was the original height of the tree okay due to the storm it got broken and the top this part now is touching the ground this is the ground okay this is the ground now the top part is here it is touching the ground what is the angle it is making it is making 30 degrees with the ground and distance between the foot of the tree and top of a tree is 6 meters so the distance between these two points is 6 meters we should find the original height of the tree okay so let us name this triangle a b and c so what is the original height of the tree if you find this part a b and then a c and add it a b plus a c that will be the original height of the tree okay before falling all right okay so now so to this angle c a b is the opposite side and a c is hypotenuse right and b c is adjacent side okay so one side is given one angle is given we need to find two sides now okay let us find opposite first we can find hypotenuse also it is a personal choice we will first find opposite in this case so opposite and adjacent is in tan formula right so tan 30 degrees is equal to opposite divided by adjacent okay tan 30 is 1 by root 3 so 1 by root 3 is equal to what is the opposite side we don't know it is ab divided by adjacent is 6 so cross multiply 6 by root 3 will be ab right okay so if roots are in the denominator we'll generally rationalize that right so let us rationalize this so this is 6 root 3 divided by root 3 into root 3 is 3 so it will get cancelled it is 2 root 3 okay so ab is equal to how much ab is 2 root 3 now let us find ac this is 2 root 3 we can use pythagoras theorem now and find ac right okay or we can use any other trigonometric ratios now like sine cos secant or cosecant isn't it so let us use uh, cos because we need hypotenuse there is adjacent there is opposite also we can use sine also right so let us use sine sine 30 degrees is equal to opposite by hypotenuse right so sine 30 is 1 by 2 opposite side is 2 root 3 hypotenuse is not known it is ac okay now cross multiply ac will become 4 root 3 2 2 is a 4 4 root 3 okay so what is ac now it is 4 root 3 okay so height of the tree before falling is ab plus ac right ab plus ac so it will be 2 root 3 plus 4 root 3 is equal to 6 root 3 meters 